meteorologist Bill Ranby with your accurate weather now forecast. It is a Ranby Factor time this evening. I say it is one of the top 10 days of the year for being and working outside in this evening. Truly tremendous. And now the air quality has improved further. This morning, yesterday, we had the unhealthy for some range of air quality. Now it's in the medium or moderate range and again, improving a little bit through the day here today. So far, 76 the high, 46 the low. Temperatures that are below the averages for the state. Rainfall, no. We're dry, more than an inch below for this month of September and more than five inches below year to date. Here's the West Dodge Expressway, the blue sky, the big Papio. That is our view from the camera at the Charles Schwab building in Old Mill. At the high of the day, 76 west breeze at 6 miles an hour and a dew point of 48. 75 Harlan, 77 Red Oak, 76 Epley, Fremont, Tecama, 77 degrees in Columbus, York and Falls City. Dew points are in the upper 40s. That feels good. Winds are light, generally 6 miles an hour or less in the viewing area. And just a little bit of ground clutter. Super Doppler 7 radar, which we sometimes see with dropping dew points. We've had no clouds in the local area. There were some showers and heavy rainfall reports around Chicago. See how that kind of stalled right there, a little upper level disturbance. Otherwise, so quiet across the country. What a nice stretch of weather. Won't stay perfectly dry going forward, and there are some rain chances in the 70s. Not tonight. Clear skies, light winds tomorrow. A little more of a breeze out of the south. High pressure edges away, so we pick up a southeast and south wind, and that will increase the moisture in the atmosphere. And so tomorrow evening and night, we'll kind of watch this area right here for a couple of showers and thunderstorms to pop. It's more likely in Iowa than Nebraska. That warm front lifts through here, and so it'll be warmer tomorrow, warmer on Tuesday, where we'll see some mid and upper 80s for the temperatures. 53 to low tonight, though, mostly clear. Light winds Monday. Very nice early. The winds pick up and we get up in the mid 80s in the afternoon. Then there's that small chance of a shower or thunderstorm tomorrow night. Tuesday again in the mid 80s. Wednesday still up around 80 for a high and Thursday. So a little warmer this week than it's been recently here. However, late week it appears that we'll have a couple more fronts in the area with increased rain chances and somewhat cooler temperatures and maybe inclement weather for the Husker game on Saturday. Oh, no, that's not good. We need the rain, I know, but yeah. the timing would be yeah. jinky.